So right now you're thinking, what, what is, is OCVTS? Well, it's Ocean County Vocational Technical School, and it's what's going to put you on the fast track to your career. At OCVTS, we offer a wide range of courses, all geared towards preparing students just like you for the future profession of their choice. We feature six major areas of study, like service occupations, construction trades, applied arts, transportation technologies, computers and design, and health technologies. No matter which path is for you, at OCVTS we're committed to giving our students the education and experience they need to excel in their field. We like this opportunity to highlight each of our areas of study and hopefully we'll answer any questions you may have along the way. Service Occupations For students seeking a career working with people, OCVTS offers a diverse range of courses. Culinary Arts gives you experience in food preparation, service, and management in a fast-paced environment. I enrolled in this program because I have such a passion for culinary arts. I run my own food blog, so I come here and I'm learning so much more. I actually just applied to Johnson & Wales in Providence, so I want to go there for four years and get my bachelor's degree in culinary arts and food service management. I hope someday to open my own bakery. Start working towards a career caring for children, ranging in age from infants through preschool. This class is child care professions class and it's amazing the things we learn in here. We get to teach kids all different lessons and we also learn about safety and effective communication, following directions the right way. It's fun. The most memorable experience is getting to see them come out their little shell and just being comfortable with us and us being comfortable with them. After I graduate, I would like to go into child psychology. Fashion design and merchandising develop skills in clothing and accessory design and retail presentation. I was very interested in fashion and I didn't really know what I wanted to do. So I talked to my guidance counselor and she recommended I take it. And it was probably the best experience of my life. Obviously we get to sew, we learn how to sew, you don't really need to know anything about fashion because you learn it all here. I took it because I wanted to learn like a trade, I really knew nothing about like sewing or anything and I wanted to learn how to do it. After graduation I want to go to OCC for two years and then transfer to a four year college for design. I am interested in going to Savannah, Georgia for four years after I graduate and to do the fashion program there. Our cosmetology program teaches students all aspects of hair, skin, and nail care, including business management, preparing the students for the state licensing exam. I'm in cosmetology, and we are learning how to style hair, how to color hair, how to do nails and facials, what we need to learn for state board exam. My favorite part of this program is coming to school every day, coming to school with girls who want to be in the program, learning new stuff every day. It's really great if you really want this to be your career path. The Academy of Law and Public Safety is a full-time educational program which explores the functions and day-to-day -day activities for local, county, state, and federal agencies. Pride! Professional results and daily effort! Keep your hands where I can see you! The reason I took this program is to pursue my career in law enforcement. I always wanted to be the one to make a difference and help people when they're in need, and I hope to be a state trooper when I end my career. I heard about the program through my guidance counselor at High School East, and I've always wanted to be a cop ever since I was little, either in the detective bureau or working as a canine. The program provides a challenging curriculum and a hands-on learning experience for college-bound and career-oriented students interested in the fields of law enforcement and homeland security. I took this class to pursue my uh, career in law enforcement. My favorite part of the day is our corrections class. It's very interesting to me, and I want to start off in corrections. When I graduate, I would like to enroll to be a dispatcher to start off, and then from there I would like to work my way up to a detective position. We're down to one, two, three. One of the benefits is we get 21 college credits that we can use for OCC, and that means a lot because we will be one step ahead of other people who are just coming out of high school. The kind of student that would do well in the school is someone that's determined, a hard worker. Cease! 
Can anyone get in? Programs are available to high school students in Ocean County. Some of the courses have prerequisites that must be met, so ask your guidance counselor for more information. And of course, early registration is always recommended. These courses fill up quick. OCVTS currently has over 2,000 students. We have six campuses in Ocean County. These six locations, as well as AM and PM sessions, keep class sizes small. Construction Trades Build skills for your future. Building construction technology teaches students framing, siding, roofing, drywall, and you'll actually build a house. I took the class because after a bunch of years of just doing hands-on activity from landscaping, and then I heard about this, so I'm like, hey, right up my alley, so why not? People in your class is more like a family. After graduation, I'm going to join the Marines, and after I get out of the Marines, join the field of construction. Begin your career as an electrician. In Electrical Trades Integrated Cabling, learn the theory, design, and application of residential wiring, as well as the fundamentals of voice, data, and video cabling. The benefit of doing two years here is that you don't have to do the first year of apprenticeship. You can go right to the second one. They teach you how to wire up uh, single family dwellings, install devices, switches, outlets, tell you how to um, rough wire, do three-way switches, four-way switches. Learn to install, repair, and maintain heating, air conditioning, and commercial refrigeration equipment in HVACR. What I like best about this course is that it's pretty hands-on. I feel like someone who likes to work with their hands and, you know, get a little dirty and get out of class a little bit would like this. Uh, program the best. If you can get into this then you're pretty much set because it's a good money-making field. I'm um, going to the University of Northwestern Ohio, proceeding my education in HVAC. Students will learn the skills needed to service, repair, and install heating and air conditioning systems as well as piping installations and basic plumbing concepts. I took the class because really I was just interested in starting a career. I didn't know if I wanted to go to college or not, so I started looking at the different bow options for trade schools. I read the description for the class, it intrigued me, so I pursued it and I ended up really liking it and now I got a job doing it. In custom woodworking and design, Students use prints, specifications, and shop drawings to plan creative, hands-on projects in the most effective manner. Mr. G is our teacher. It's a great class, very hands-on. You can do what you like and make what you want. I looked into this class and found it was exactly what I was looking for. Does welding spark your interest? Then let our hands-on program show you a variety of welding and metal fabrication processes. We learn all different tensile strengths, all different types of welding, cutting, brazing, anything that has to deal with metal. The main reason I took the course is I wanted to better myself, so I gave it a shot and I've loved it ever since. I love just welding, getting in the shop, learning. When would I go and how would I get there? Part of every school day would be spent at OCVTS. A bus will pick you up and return you to your high school. You'd still take classes at your high school, participate in sports and activities, and graduate from there. In Burke Memorial, I am in class executive. I am involved in the marching band and color guard. So I have a lot to do over at Brick, but I love coming here too. Applied Arts. Students enrolled in design and visual communications will learn a wide variety of skills to be competent in many multimedia careers. We do video production, we do editing, multimedia. We also learn how to make business cards, posters, and all that stuff. We also have a photography course. Take courses in digital art and design, animation, web design, and video production. I took this course mainly for animation, but I learned that I like being down in the print shop a little bit more. Learn the traditional and digital techniques of photography, film, darkroom processing, and studio lighting. Study digital reproduction with courses in screen printing and production graphics. 
I took the course to help with my drawing. I wanted to be able to draw something and then upload it onto the computer and edit it through there, being able to Photoshop my pictures that I take. Can I still go to college? Of course. OCVTS encourages students to further their education after graduation. In most cases, you'll even have a head start. Many of the courses allow you to earn college credits in your field while learning the valuable skills you need anyway. Contact your guidance counselor to find out the benefits of the program you're interested in. In addition to college credits, some courses offer internships, job placement, and licensing certificates. Transportation Technologies Automotive technology introduces the concepts and theories of maintenance, service, and repair. I always fell in love with uh, working on cars and you know, I'm where I want to be and it's awesome. I work at uh, Downs Ford part-time and then um, as soon as I graduate from here in homeschool I'll be working full-time there as a C-Tech. After graduation I'm trying to go to the University of Northwestern Ohio. The thing I like about this program is um, being able to go in the shop, learn more, and then some time in the, in the classroom. Diesel engine technology explores the fundamentals of gas and diesel engines. We learned theory and basically how to work on cars, big and small, from the Windstar all the way up to a Brigadier. Everything's hands-on. If you're not book smart, then you're going to learn with your hands. I plan on attending Brookdale Community College for two years, learn more about automotives. Collision Repair teaches auto body repair, refinishing, and other crucial skills required by the collision repair industry. We're taught how to maintain cars. Uh, we are taught how to sand cars, paint them, prime. It's a bit of everything, how to restore, basically. It's classes for anybody who really likes working on cars, has a passion about cars, and anyone that likes working with their hands. I'm thinking about going to a technical college, going for a business, and eventually work my way up to own my own shop. Marine service technology concentrates on the mechanical repair and maintenance of all types of watercraft. I'm really into boats. I really like boats. I've always liked them my whole life. I wanted to get into like, the field of maybe having a marina or opening up a shop or something. My favorite part of every day is basically coming out here and just you know working on things with all the motors and all that. You know, doing outdrive stuff, whether it be Merkers or you know, troubleshooting engines. You know, troubleshooting everything with all the problems going on. Students spend time in the shop and on the water. After graduation, I plan on going to Automotive Training Center and becoming a successful marine technician and having a good job out in the field. When can we apply? Applications are already being sent in. So if you see a course that's right for you, talk to your guidance counselor and fill one out today. Computers and Design. These courses are great for anyone who wants a comprehensive and practical background in a computer-related field. The name of the course is Computer Service Repair, or CSR, and what we do is we fix computers and try to protect them against future threats. Learn entry-level skills, like theory of PC operation, assembly, and troubleshooting. What made me take this class was I wanted to be able to fix computers, and it's a really growing, expanding field and has a lot of opportunities. Computer science gives students a foundation in programming and web design. The first year I was in it, we created programs with JavaScript and Visual Basic. That was more geared towards applications for phones and computers. Now this year, we're doing website design. I picked this class because uh, I wanted to go into something computer related. I always knew I was into computers. My favorite part of this course is probably learning the code for uh, the websites and knowing how everything gets put together. After I graduate, I'm going to go to Rutgers University to study computer science. In pre-engineering technology, students apply engineering principles and technical skills to the identification and resolution of production problems in the digital fabrication process. Starts with the mechanical engineering, shows you how to do hand drafting, and then soon we'll move into the um, computer drafting using CAD software. I took it because I uh, found an interest in architectural, uh, mainly house designing. Students will be exposed to the current and relevant career pathways in related industry sectors such as industrial, mechanical, and electronic engineering. It's really hands-on. After I graduate, I hope to 
become a licensed architect and start my own architectural firm designing high-end homes. How much does it cost? That's the best part. As long as you're a high school student in Ocean County, the courses are free. A few classes may require small fees for uniforms or other activities, but the resources and technology available are priceless. Health Technologies In medical skills and related health careers, students explore different options in the medical field. In this program, you learn all the basics of like the medical field. At the end of your second year, you get your CNA certification. My favorite part of this class is being able to like make new friends and meet new people, and also like going on clinical because you get like a really hands-on experience with like the field. I took this class because I want to be a nurse anesthetist, and it takes two years off your college. The type of student that would do really well in this class is like if you're dedicated and if you know what you want to be. After graduation, I would like to enroll in a four-year RN program. The medical assistant course emphasizes physician assisting skills, including vital sign monitoring, electrocardiogram administration, and venipuncture. Here we learn both clinical and administrative skills. I decided to take this course because I've always been interested in the medical field, and I do have a desire and willingness to help people, so I believe this course has given me the opportunity to basically start my way into the medical field. I always had a desire to help people, so I thought this would be a good program to help me get into the medical field. After I graduate, I want to go to college to be a physical therapist. Health and fitness technology introduces students to the fields of fitness, personal training, nutrition, and physical rehabilitation. We learn about the five components of fitness, how to weightlift properly. And they teach us about the anatomy, I took it because I would love to become a physical therapist in my future. Well, this class isn't just about getting big, it's about actually the science about it. After graduation, I plan to go to the University of Delaware and uh, be an occupational therapist. Dental assisting teaches the vital aspects of working in the dental field, including dental hygienist, lab or x-ray technician, and even a dentist. Last year we learned how to seat a patient, grind models, we learned how to mount an x-ray, and this year we're learning more hands-on stuff. Kind of get the feel for how it is to work in an office since we have treatment rooms. When I was younger, I always enjoyed going to the dentist, and my older sister actually took this course, and she really enjoyed it. Are your graduates usually successful? Well, see for yourself. I can safely say that if I didn't attend the Ocean County Vocational School, I probably wouldn't be as successful as I am right now. Uh, with the experience that I obtained and the classes that I had completed, uh, my resume and my experience looked a lot more professional to the Ocean County Sheriff's Department when I was hired. My name is John Kate and I graduated the Homeland Security Program in 2014 and I'm currently employed as a full-time dispatcher with the Ocean Township Police Department. Even being with Supercuts as a district manager, I am very active within the Vocational School Society, making sure that they're the first ones that I recruit because I feel that, honestly, they have the most to give, they're the most enthusiastic, and the best well-groomed that we could work with in the industry. I feel that it's a great opportunity for the high school students of Ocean County to take advantage of this program to get you ready for the challenges ahead for them, either going to school or jumping right into the business of the food service industry. Graduates know OCVTS teaches the skills you'll need and use throughout your professional career. So now you know exactly what OCVTS is and what it can do for you. It's a great way to gain knowledge and experience in your future field. And it doesn't interfere with your high school education, sports, or activities. It enriches them using a hands-on approach to apply what you're already learning to your specific interests. So if you like what you see and you want to get practical training, earn college credits, and most of all, have fun, talk to your guidance counselor today about enrolling into a course at OCVTS. Remember, life's a journey. Better get good directions.